Hey everyone, remember my channel trailer? Well, uh, well, it said gaming, tuto gaming tutorials, people in vlogs, and an indie game maker. The tutorials will be on Click Team Fusion and Minecraft. Well, for this episode, it will be Cl Click Team Fusion. So, let's get started. Alright, so, I'm just laying screen. You can click open if you have any applications you might want to open. And, <coughs> sorry, please. And, and you can click new. Right now we're going to click new and I'm going to name it tutorial. Not good. Now, just like click on frame one. I have the grid and the snap to grid enabled, but you won't have that. You will have you'll have this, but I uh, you can put show grid and snap the grid if you want to up here. I've also seen different layouts that people had. <coughs> so um yeah, let's just start. So today we are gonna do a top down shooter. So let's insert an object, an active object. Hey, shut up! I'm making a video. Go in there. Sorry, sorry about that. Um, can't just like do this and do this, or just. Pam bucket tool <coughs> and then you have that so and we're gonna make another active object there and this one right here which will be the bullet it's gonna be yellow and then this one will be the enemy now uh, just one second uh, so I just had to go chat for something so have this old guy here so we click this, set it eight directions, top down, and sure is isn't all that detailed, but we'll make it detailed later. <clears throat> Same with the ball in the back. Now, can I do qualifiers, fires and everything? Like, all these which I've which I haven't even done yet. Then the object door was in yours. Oh hold on. No cares. Dangerous power ups. Yeah, all this stuff. Everything. Explosions for rolls and PC and stuff. But, uh, let's just make him a bouncing ball for right now. Bouncing ball. I'm gonna change the. Now. Actually, no. Just gonna do this. I'm gonna have location, which you can press out. F8, which will run the entire game right here. F7, which will run the current frame. So, I just go for this. Goes off the screen. You can move around with the arrow keys, and you also go off the screen. And also, can't fire any bolts right now. Oh, wow. So, we gotta fill that in. So, 
Mm, test decision of active two. Click. So mm, click on new condition. Go to active two. Oh, name it enemy. And position test position of active two. And you click all these are leaving the frame area. That leaves your play area. It will bounce. That's it. So now you can also do this for this guy. Stop. No, no, no. Messing up. Space bar. Your schedule I launch. Nothing's happening when we hit the enemy. As you can see, nothing's happening when the enemy hits us. So, let's just make a game over screen real quick. It's not no uh, it doesn't have to be an exact center. Can can if you you can if you want to. And this is game over. So let's go when this collisions the object at the it will next frame. Now, time right? every three, two, we should the application. And let's just do one more thing. This collisions not it that it will. Game over. It's over. Yay! Um, <coughs> now it's just adding some more enemies. I think I've added too much for many enemies. And that's how to make first top down shooter. Very good. Now, I'm just gonna, um, name. Good. 
and the next episode I'll show you how to make a platformer game. And actually, I'll show you how to make these like a uh, more detail. So, save it as that. There you go. Save. Exit out. And that's how you basically make a game. See you guys in the next episode. Or whatever. Bye.